there, YouTube. Long time no see. Are you the single one out of your friend group? Well, Selena Gomez can relate. I'm totally fine being <laughs> single. It's a real thing. It's fine. She is as an international superstar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, is, it really, is this uh, fine? Are you fine with this situation if you've been in it? I love being the third wheel because if I'm not having fun, I just drop subjects that will cause conflict in the couple. Like, I love that. So I love it. What do you guys think about porn? You know, and then it just ignites a conversation. Yeah, uh -oh. I do like the family friendly version of that. And like with my brothers with his girlfriend, I'll go. Have you guys said you loved each other yet? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Lonnie? Nothing. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Phil, let Kelly Clarkson in on a little secret. If you want to know if a person is lying, you can look for these clues. Well, you know, when people meet for the first time, there's usually 10 lies within the first hour or two. What? Why would you do that? you got to keep up with it. Well, I... It's just trying to impress, I guess. Oh. But you can tell if people are lying, particularly if they're being interrogated, 90% okay. of their time, their feet will be pointed towards the exit. What? And if they repeat the question, it's not because they didn't hear you. They're buying time so they can formulate an answer. And thirdly, when you hear somebody say, I swear to God, oh. the next thing out of their mouth is a damn lie. <laughs> <laughs> Poor God. You know, my feet have been pointed towards this essay for, like <laughs> for the entire week, I think. Now I know why. I lie down. Okay, that sounded wrong. <laughs> oh, no, no. I just meant like I um, under exaggerate things so people are like underwhelmed by me. Does that make sense? I understand what you're saying. Yeah. I understand what you're saying. Yeah. Like yeah. I'm not volunteering juicy bits of information, mm -hmm. I'm keeping it. Yeah, you're not you know, inflating. Uh huh. Yeah. yeah, I don't. I don't believe that ten, ten yeah. lies in the. No. I, I don't that's believe a, that. That's literally every subject you're lying about. Yeah, like your name. Yeah, <laughs> your yeah. age. Yeah. Well, the problem is Dr. Phil's social circle is like the guests he has come <laughs> on his show, and so it's like a bunch of people who. F Lie, you exactly. Know? <laughs> exactly. But he is right about the toes, because my toes are still. Can we be done? Yeah, we're almost done. I had a, <laughs> I just have one long story. My teacher, uh, when I was in middle school, his son lied, and he knew that his son lied about something, like breaking a vase. He saw it happen, but the son didn't know. Okay. And when he ca called his son out, he said, "Did you break the vase?" And the son said, "No." And the dad said, "My teacher." He goes. Uh, I can tell you're lying because your eyes always get uh, real wide whenever you lie. So anytime the kid lied after that, he, he would squint his eyes a little bit. <laughs> oh my and God. And he could always tell when his son was lying. So <laughs> that's good information. And on that note, we're out of time. Uh, well, you know what to do. Comment down below. We'll see you later. Bye bye. Woo!